What's going on guys? I'm gonna use this 2006 Jeep Grand Cherokee to point out to you the location of the two relays and the two fuses for the cooling fan. So to start with, pop this open. We've got your low and your high speed cooling fan relays. And in the past, I've had some success with tapping on them to see if they're stuck and I, maybe I can get them unstuck. We're gonna pop these out here and I'll point out to you what each one of these pins do. Uh, but before we get to that, this J-Case Fuse 50 amp, that provides the power that goes to the cooling fans. Uh, this 20 amp fuse, it doesn't directly power the fans, but it helps send power to the front control module, which in turn controls the relays. So all of these red pins that I've marked, they receive constant power from that 50 amp fuse. The green signifies the pin that gets a ground signal from the control module when that relay is to be energized. And when the relay is energized, it takes power from this pin and it sends it to the one across from it. So on your low speed, this pin will receive power when the low speed mode is engaged. And that goes to a dark green slash dark blue wire present at the cooling fan. For the high speed, when that gets energized, that sends power to a dark blue slash dark green wire uh, that goes to the cooling fan. Yes, I know they're very similar colors. This one being dark green, dark blue, and that one is dark blue, dark green. Someone at Chrysler has a good sense of humor. Um, but yeah, if you do want to swap in other relays as a troubleshooting step, the only other place on the car I know of where you can find relays like that are going to be right here. So these relays are identical. They'll swap right in. So yeah, I hope this was helpful for you guys. Please be sure to let me know if you have any questions or more importantly, if you have any advice about troubleshooting the cooling fan on your grand.